It's gonna be a full computer build. The benchmarks you're about to see are pretty hard to believe, so I wanna show you. So it's gonna be a bit of a longer video with you today show you how long it actually takes to build an entire computer all these all this stuff will be linked in the description so you can literally do this with me so right now what i'm doing is the arrow at the bottom left and then the air the arrow this plate says an arrow so what i'm going to do is i'm going to line this cpu up with the my hands will let me do it so there's that and now there's clips on the top of the cpu thing and it does sound like you're breaking it but you're definitely not breaking it i promise you're not breaking it i always think i'm about to break it because i break everything but i promise you're not going to break it if i didn't just break that you won't break it trust me so your m.2 may or may not have a sticker on it and if it tells you warranty voided you still need to remove it your NVMe is going to have a slot and all you're going to do is you're going to you're going to line it up i mean if it's the other way you do it this way like this right here you would do it this way but i'm going to do it at the top because it doesn't have a heat sink and that is a heat sink so i'm going to put it up at the top here make sure my motherboard doesn't move grab our little screw don't need to use the one that's with that NVMe. I'm gonna push this down. Screw this. All I'm gonna be doing right now is throwing the motherboard down up in here and screwing it down. So this part will probably be edited so that you guys don't have to. Yeah, I hate it when motherboards. Yeah, I... <laughs> yeah, I really do. I hate it when all motherboards try to do something different. Yo, so I'm gonna. I'm going to plug this in to the motherboard. Alright, so your motherboard's going to label everything for you. But most of the time, it's like, this is going to be on the far left, and then this is going to be, like, all the way over here. But this motherboard has a ton of RGBs. There is a reason. I don't even think I need those adapters. There's a ridiculous oh my goodness i can't see oh so they oh it's not as bad as some cases yo okay so it's not so they just combine that's why there's not as many of them i actually got power i'm gonna do this one first so we got hard drive plus minus and then the motherboard says plus minus Alrighty, so I'm gonna show you how to connect the power supply. Hey, I really don't want to, but I have to, guys. I really, I like, I have to do it, okay? That's what she said. I have to do it. I have to do it. I had to angle that to put it up on in there. Ah, yeah, I can do it again. That's what she said. Put this up on in there. That is a really tight fit. I guess it gets snug in there. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah, I can do it. 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 Because now it's not going to rattle the bottom. Flip this guy around for you so you can see. Yo, I can't see it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why I really got to put a light over there. Oh, my goodness. Dude, I don't understand why they... So, I'm going to show you guys. So, no. I don't understand why... I really don't understand why they do this. Oh, get out of here. Oh, baby. Like, why do you need two of them? I've never seen a graphics card that uses only this little freaking one. So you gotta, like, you know, as you're plugging it in, you have to, like, hold it, and then you gotta, like, push it in as you're squeezing it. Why? I like my card, dude. I like the way it looks. But, dude, like, the 4070T, this is the only the 4070, but the 4070Ti performs just as good as my 3090 in there, dude. And it just, it... It makes me cry. It makes me so sad. And it makes me sad. Because. It is like one fourth of the price. I will show you. So. 
I'm gonna put that guy down. I do have an extra one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go grab my box of extra bit of extra extensions really quick. Uh, I'm feeling really dumb right now, dude. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and these ones I don't know what these are for, so I'm not even gonna bother. Not that this GP really needs it, but it's still pretty neat. I'll take our little sleeve or a cable sleeve. This is a pain in the butt. I hate doing this. You know it as much as I know it. Everybody here knows it. Has ever done it before? <laughs> Yo, I've done it so many times. But how many times have we done it? I'm probably like what number five at this point. Where I'm about to say that's what she said. Already. Oh my god. Okay, I was gonna say I better not have messed that up. That actually kind of no okay. Oh my god, what even do you mean? How is that? Um, I got these because I wanted to use the fans rather than buy new ones. That's why I installed the front one first. What is this thing? Or maybe that's not the right one. Maybe I'm. Okay, never mind. It's not the right one. Yeah, see, this is what I was saying was cool. So I can, like, literally. Your boy needs to and I'm hoping so badly that I can actually reach stuff I'm gonna be so angry if I can't oh no way yo 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 I got another extra one sick this just looks so much better than that other thing cord button yeah that looks fire dude braided cables for the win <laughs> yeah, when you can't see, bro, you take the panel off. That's how you figure stuff out. Ready? I need to hang my hang my headset up. Whoop. It's it's small, stupid stuff like that that makes some cases really cool. Personal opinion. What? Oh, it's an infinity head. No, I didn't I didn't intentionally order that, yo. That's sick, bro. No way. You see the infinity at the end? Yo, that's so dope, bro. I didn't even know that. Look at it. Cause it was it was like mirrored. I've done it. That's how I knew it because I've done a computer build with that. Water, dude. That's sick. That's so cool. But oh it actually did it for me, yo. I'm so happy with you. This you're number two, dude. That's so sick. What this this AIO 100 percent I don't even need to like I don't even have to task it, dude. Pre-installed screws. Pre-installed fans. Pre-installed. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited for you. There's an arrow. And then on the back of your your AIO, there's all there's gonna be all right, so the arrow's right here. So I'm uh Oh no, I swear if you make me do undo this, dude. Why would you do it that way? It's stupid stuff like this that always makes the builds 10 million years longer. It's not that big of a deal. It's literally eight screws, but still. I like putting the pump over on this. It looks better to me. I like the way it looks more. This is what I'm talking about. Like the magnetic screwdrivers, dude, they, they really do. They come in handy. I have an electric one, dude, but I, I hate I don't like it. I it They're all pains in my butts. To be honest. Those all kinds of thermal paste methods that you can do. I'm literally just gonna use the, the grain of rice just because of the, the shape of the CPU is like, it's long. So I'm just gonna go like this. I'm 
it should be enough all right so that's one so as you can see like that's why i was worried about uh the the aio placement because the cp power is right there all right so that's two <laughs> what's gonna get in my way i'd have been so upset so i need one of those things because i know i'm not gonna use all of them so all right so this one should probably Woo -y. all right so you know what i'm actually gonna redo this because so this is the one all right so either of these can go there so now i gotta find an rgb header i'm gonna run into that same problem i can't see so i'm gonna take this off again boys so i can actually see what i'm doing all right, my friends, you know what? I just barely realized that my camera ended up shutting off when we were putting the memory in, installing Windows, doing all of the benchmarks and stuff. However, I'll have some benchmarks on screen for you guys now. So this is the parts inside of this computer that we used. We used the Asus Z790 motherboard. We used an Intel i3-13100. We got one terabyte NVMe. We got the Corsair RAM. We got the MSI 4070, a 750 watt power supply, and this Thermalrite cooler is awesome. Two days later, so I'm going to be driving down to Newfound Lakes where my dad lives, and uh, yeah, it's going to be going to its new owner.